In our data-driven world, Flourish is the perfect solution for any journalist looking to tell impactful and engaging stories. Best of all, you don't need to be a data viz or numbers expert. And you don't need any coding capabilities or experience. Flourish is simple enough for anyone to pick up. And it's also flexible and polished enough to use in professional newsroom projects. At its core, it's a tool created by journalists for journalists to help tell stories that matter with speed and ease. Stick around and I'll show you how. Hi, I'm Lindsay, Head of Customer Enablement at Flourish. If you work in journalism, you will already know it's a cluttered world out there with everyone vying for your audience's attentions and affection. That's why making sense of data, giving it context, and portraying it in a way that's easily understood is critical. Thankfully, Flourish empowers you to do just that. With smart animations to make all your data visualizations more dynamic, data-driven content from racing bar charts to fully functioning maps, and step-by-step -step storytelling to engage your audience and bring them along the journey all of which is interactive, making the data explorable and understandable. And that's what we want, to further enhance engagement with your audience, right? Plus, it can be dropped into any Canva design and be themed with your newsroom styling, similar to Canva's brand kit, because we know that keeping your content on brand is critical when trying to attract and keep loyal audiences. That's why we're trusted by hundreds of newsrooms and thousands of journalists all around the globe, garnering billions of views. Let's start creating our own Flourish Viz and then we'll drop it into Canva and publish for all to see. Once you sign in, you can start creating visualizations straight away. Just like Canva, Flourish offers hundreds of pre-made templates for you to choose from and combine. It also allows you to upload custom maps or design your own templates. And there's no limit to the number of projects you're allowed to create. Okay, enough window shopping, let's create something. An easy one to begin with is a scatterplot visualization here. A great chart to show relationships between variables. Let's go to the data tab. Here you can see dummy data. This is useful to look at, to see what format your data needs to be in for the template to work. Next, we'll upload our CSV by clicking here. Now we need to add the column bindings for our visualization. I'll plot the year, column B, and then budget, column O. Next, add the column binding for colour. I'll choose column G, which has the data for the outcome of the injury. Now, when you go to the preview tab, you'll see your data plotted. That's looking great. Finally, we'll add a title. We can do this by opening the header tab and writing it in. Now you'll notice this is fully interactive. I can hover over the points for more info and turn outcomes on and off like this. Put the file name up here. All right, that's feeling really good. Once you've finished your data viz design, the best way to embed in Canva is to install the Flourish app. This makes all your Flourish projects appear in the object panel, even if they're not publicly published. It's very easy. Let's jump into Canva and I'll show you how. I've pre-made a social media post that is just dying for an attention-grabbing data viz. Simply go here and click to find the Flourish app. Sign in to link your account and now you can see the design you've just made in Flourish. Click or drag and drop and you can start editing right here in Canva. They're all responsive and resizable, not to mention fully interactive. I need to add the brand. In Canva, just select the brand hub. This is where you can house your brand colors, logos, and fonts, and everything else you need to stay consistent. Add the logo here. Hit this button to apply your palette. Hit it again to shuffle. Yes, that's looking good. 
Simple, isn't it? Now let's publish so everyone can see. Simply head to the share button here. Down here you'll see the menu for sharing on social. With one click you can upload your post or even schedule it to post at the most appropriate time. Handy, isn't it? As I'm sure you'll know, social media is a critical part of the journalism process, allowing you to reach a much larger audience, gather insight, interact with your viewers, and share breaking news faster than ever. Let's build this post into a carousel so we can tell more of a story. In Canva, this is easy. I'll add some additional pages like this. Hold tight while I quickly plan out these pages. Okay, that's feeling easy to follow. Now I can jump over to Flourish and start creating the visualizations I need. Scroll down to the 3D maps. Let's use this one. Let's jump into the data tab. Because our data is based on the exact locations and not regions, let's click here on the points tab. Here we can add our data. I'll just clear this dummy data first. I'll copy and paste the data from another sheet. You also have the options uploaded CSV if you prefer. Next, we need to update the column bindings on the right. I'm also adding a scale column, so our circles are scaled according to values in column B. Here it's people injured in a movie. So back on the preview, we can see the data has been added. Let's style our map. We begin in the base map tab. Hmm, let's do two-tone. And I can rejig the colours here. Next, go to the points tab and we can change their colour so they stand out. I'll change the minimum point size so you can see all the points better. That's looking great. Add the name in here. Back in my Canva template, I can go into my Flourish app. And there you are, my map is waiting for me. Simply drag it in and start fitting it into the story you want to tell. Let me just finish this quickly. Okay, that's looking really great. In no time at all, you'll have a social post that is data rich and telling a deeper, more compelling story than just a text and image post. And now that you have your visualizations made, you can use them across multiple platforms. For instance, say you want to add one of these to your website. Well, that's simple. Back in Flourish, if you want to have a go at any of the visualizations we've shown in this tutorial, we've added links in the description where you can duplicate and edit to your heart's content. It's really the best way to learn. While Flourish is a powerful tool on its own, with the power of Canva, you can unlock the potential to create new and enticing content on any platform, in any format, or for any audience. Got questions and comments? Great. Drop them below and we'll make sure to get back to you ASAP. Why, hello there. Good to see you're sticking around. Need more design inspiration? Check out our playlist. We have lots of tutorials conducted by design experts about all sorts of topics. Want more journalism specific content and how to's? Check out this playlist with Jono. While you're there, make sure you subscribe. I can't wait to see the stories you tell.